Howdy, 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 my beautiful Gemini. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Velka, and today we're going to get into your weekly tarot reading, Gemini, for June. All right, so if you enjoy this tarot readings today, Gemini, be sure to check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign because that's how you make the most out of uh, receiving general tarot readings on YouTube or anywhere else, darling, is to make sure that you customize your message with your entire chart, darling. All right, as well, Gemini, if you want to support me, darling, the best way to do it is by just giving this video a like, subscribe to the family, darling, if you haven't already. Already, you're already here hello uh, and just let me know how this tarot reading resonates with you if it does of course darling all right but let's just jump right into your tarot reading here gemini let's see what's going on with you guys what's good what's popping with you honey all right all right so darling i guess we're starting out with four cards so a message really needs to be had all right usually i only start out with three so for you guys gemini looks pretty solid you have the king as well as the six of wands coming in wow okay three of cups coming in here as well as the ace of swords all right gemini so i see you guys gemini really doing some big things here all right really really doing some big things when you think about the six of wands the six of wands is my favorite card in the minor arcana because the six of wands represents that fame it represents that fortune it represents you being noticed for who you are and your hard work all right uh, i almost called you Libra. All right, Gemini. And then you also complement this with the King of Wands here. All right, I'm going to hold these two up so... Uh, the King of Wands represents a similar theme of, of a message here where it's like the King of Wands commands uh, attention. All right. When you walk into a room, Gemini, you draw attention from everyone in the room. All right. And so I see for many of you, Gemini's, you're going like in terms of for those that are like, you know, whatever way that you benefit in terms of the spotlight here, I see a lot more traction in that way. Don't be surprised, Gemini, if you start noticing people starting to approach you more, just wanting to understand you more, Gemini, like what makes you tick all right because you're really being noticed by a lot of people at this time and i also gemini want you to take this as a message of where it's like you know uh do more some of you guys gemini are like paralysis by over analysis and i feel like that's due to your perfectionism gemini because you you know if you see this as where it's like if it's not my best velka i don't want to post it darling i understand that but what it is that you're saying is that unless it's perfect then uh what it is that you create doesn't have value and that's just not the reality just because it's not perfect doesn't mean it doesn't deserve to be seen all right the only way that you're going to manifest more success or abundance in your life gemini is by uh putting yourself out there and putting you know by putting you know create putting stuff out all right if you constantly have all these wonderful ideas that i yes, see you having with the ace of swords maybe you'd always talk to your close friends and family and you're just like oh man i have this wonderful business idea i have this wonderful idea that would be really cool but you never execute it then what good are those wonderful ideas all right I feel like for you guys right now, Gemini, you would gain a lot of value through collaborations. Three of Cups also represents a celebration and victory. All right. So really solid news is coming in for you guys, Gemini. All right. And especially rewarding those that have been putting in the work and not paying, not, not even giving a single care in the world about other people's perceptions. All right. Because the reality is here, Gemini. All right. I know a lot of you guys might not want to be perceived. All right. You might be insecure or like just not wanting to have a bunch of eyes on you darling but the reality is like that's just that's just what's going to be happening for you gemini all right and the sooner that you accept that reality and get comfortable with that idea the more success that's going to be coming to uh towards you guys here all right this is really a call to action for you gemini to start taking more physical action towards your ideas here all right because you'll be thinking yourself three months down the road at the end of this year six months down the road darling be like you know what velka i'm so glad that you pushed me darling into taking action with these things because you know you know you might be starting from scratch right now it may not be perfect right now but six to months down the road darling i can guarantee you i'm willing to put money on it gemini that what it, what you start right now is going to be insanely profitable for you six months down the road especially for those that have been contemplating doing something with social media right the six of wands is a very powerful card for social media all right and so truly 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 gemini you get rewarded through i get like collaborations as well with that three of cups all right you have the five of swords coming in here why is that five of swords there as well as the ten of wands so here's the thing gemini i feel like for some of you guys you've been playing it a little bit too safe you've been down in the, like you've been 
it's because of everything that you've been having to deal with in your own personal life. Maybe it's just like every time you just like, I feel like you've constantly been dealing with complication after complication, technical, technical issue after technical issue, darling. All right. And so I feel like that's what's been weighing you down. You've been playing it a little bit too safe because of that. All right. You probably haven't been, you know, we just finished Mercury retrograde. All right. And I know, I know, I know the Gemini is just like, sometimes it just feels like we're always going through some type of Mercury retrograde. Right. But I feel like for many of you guys, this mercury retrograde really took you by storm like really it was really difficult for you guys all right and so what i want you guys to be doing is prioritizing getting yourself out of that funk all right out of that mindset of what it is that you've been having to deal with that streak of bad luck or just what have you here because it's like the more risks that you take the more bold that you are at this current point in time gemini is where the success is all right because i can be telling you until the cows come home darling about the success that i see with you with this king of wands six of wands here but it's not going to happen without some type of action here this is not to be time to be playing it safe all right if it's not perfect darling Oh, well, the only people that are actually going to be judging you are people who are sitting on their couch, sitting on their chair, darling, doing nothing. All right. You know, Gemini, I, the people always ask me, Gemini, being like, oh, Valka, how do you deal with the hate and all the naysayers and, and all that? And it's like, the reality is, darling, I don't. 100% I just don't, darling. I block when I keep my day going because I put it in perspective. No one that is actually happy with themselves is trying to find someone else to critique and bring them down because they're too busy focusing on their blessings. All right. So some of y'all need to have that pep talk with yourself and realize that it's just like the only people that are going to look down upon you about putting yourself out there are people that really shouldn't matter to you they're irrelevant you know we don't care about them darling don't give them you're essentially saying these strangers are more valuable these strangers opinions who really are doing nothing with their lives are more valuable to you than the dream life that you can manifest or just what the rewards that you would reap from these ideas here i feel as if with this ace of swords your spiritual team has really been trying to push you into just doing something right the ace of swords also is a card about action you can't lose when you have the ace of swords on your side here for those that are spiritually practicing though i do deeply feel like your spiritual team has been trying to push you into doing some type of um project or just you know taking action with something that you've been sitting on your mind for it's like you're sitting on like a million dollar idea essentially i was just shown like shark tank so that's what makes me think of it. it's like you're sitting on a million dollar idea here gemini and it's just like what good is a million dollar idea if you don't <laughs> if you don't do anything with it then it's just a, you could be rich with it but you sitting on it is not going to be feeding your bank account any darling all right so we have coming in here the nine of cups king of swords coming in here as well as the queen of wands coming in here all right so this is really pushing back a narrative here, Gemini, of like, y'all are going to be finding somebody or some bodies here. I feel like, I I don't know, I just feel like group projects really greatly reward you here, all right? I feel like this is like you starting to create like... A mastermind group here all right i feel as if you guys are going to gemini start surrounding yourself with people that have their own personal passions that are just as motivated as you are um and they help you uh, accomplish your goals here all right what i want to be telling you right now gemini is like what you don't you, you know i was just having that pep talk with you where i was just like you know even if it's not perfect darling it's still worth worthy of being seen I think the reality is like to everybody else, you know, I feel like everyone else would be amazed by what it is that you create, amazed by what it is that you do. The only reason why you don't think that it would be very good or what have you or valuable is because it's been just sitting in your head, right? You know your potential better than anybody else, but just because you know that you could push yourself even further doesn't mean that like what you put out there isn't going to be freaking fabulous. All right. If I waited uh, Gemini to create this YouTube channel, until i found the perfect setup honestly honey i would have created this youtube channel up until this year darling probably now this is the happiest that i'm with my setup and i'm still not even happy with it i still got some stuff to do since i recently moved to gemini all right and so some of y'all need to realize that all right just because you know your own personal potential and like what you could be doing if you had all the resources darling like people would people are going to see what it is that you create and respect it greatly here all right again like you guys like 
y'all are just being a little bit too critical on yourself here it's like you have like it's like you painted like the mona lisa darling all right you painted the mona lisa and we all know how you know how i i granted i know the a cake was thrown at the mona lisa recently but you know how iconic the mona lisa is darling imagine if the mona lisa wasn't created because that artist i feel, honestly doll, dolls don't be coming after me i don't remember the artist's name i don't care um, but it's just like imagine if the artist that created the mona lisa held back because they're just like oh the shading wasn't perfect da, 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 da. but again how every the world sees it darling i mean now we still like worship the mona lisa you know and think about it that way what it is that you're creating the ideas that you have are timeless all right you guys are becoming a trailblazer in your own way the reason why i say that so confidently is with that queen of wands so gemini y'all are really becoming trailblazers in your field here and you just need to give yourself more credit and just continuously put yourself out there more all right literally the more that you put yourself out the better better off you are going to more success that you're going to be having all right you have the hmm, okay darling you have both the two as well as the six of cups and then the chariot energy coming in here all right a couple different messages here one again we're talking about partnerships and receiving some type of art uh, <laughs> receiving some type of offer or some type of contract to work together with somebody here uh gemini so i feel like again like if you were to put yourself out there all right again your work is going to be seen by the appropriate people and people are going to be approaching you gemini wanting to work with you wanting to collaborate with you wanting to get a piece of the pie before you start really blowing up here gemini that's really what makes me think about this here all right y'all are really on the right path here and the only way to continue on this chair to go further forward in a quicker way is by letting other energies in when they come in but these energies cannot come in unless you put yourself out there and start being about action another part to this message here i feel like someone that you have a history with this is going to be for a very specific amount of people here gemini but i feel like for some of you guys y'all have a relationship that you have a history with with the six of cups here y'all are definitely you you i feel like you hit a bump on the road recently with them here y'all are definitely going to be developing at a much quicker pace now the pace about y'all's relationship is going to be ramping up big time here with that two of cups energy here i don't feel like it's going to be like i don't feel like this is like new romance or anything like that for people i feel like we're tapping it into in, at least in this dynamic here i feel like we're tapping into like a connection in your life whether it's romance or a close friend or what have you here y'all are really going to be uh your relationship is really going to be thriving and getting stronger here let's get one final card here <clears throat> nine of swords so yeah y'all were having anxiety about it here all right maybe there is some distance lack of communication some fighting here gemini all right but in the coming days y'all's relationship are going to be developing into a much more beautiful level here so don't be stressing out about it right now easier said than done though darling right i understand so y'all have the third quarter moon adjustments are required here and the adjustments really uh that are for you here uh gemini is you all just taking action that's the adjustments that are needed y'all have been telling yourself constantly that you just like you need to do all these adjustments for these projects before you do it darling but the really the only adjustment is is you just pushing submit is you pushing enter is you post uh pushing post darling that's the adjustment that needs to be happening for you all right you also have the zebra card coming in here let go of your fear and know that you're safe and protected at all times darling all right so every step of this way darling you are not going to be alone on this journey your spiritual team is not going to let you fall flat on your face when it comes to these new projects when it comes to you taking action here on the contrary your spiritual team is going to be celebrating you gemini because you're finally putting yourself out there because this is exactly what your spiritual team has been waiting for for you is for, for you to finally take action like i'm hearing applause right now here gemini all right so so again like a lot of good things coming in for you here gemini but you need to give your yourself and your energy and your cap uh, and your skill and talent more credit all right um and yeah darling that's what i the tarot reading that i got for you this week here gemini hopefully you found some tarot cards that did resonate with you darling if it did let me know in the comments below be sure to give this video a like and subscribe gemini also remember darling if you want to book a live reading with me i only do readings through my website simply Velka. Dot com be sure to follow my social medias tiktok and instagram here uh darling gemini uh simply valka same as here darling and hopefully i can connect with you sometime in the near future gemini all right i love you so much darling bye